everyone, it's me Alex and today my friend Lucy is going to be... Yes, that was your cue. Oh. <laughs> Lucy's going to be... Ah! <laughs> Wait, no. It's everyone's favourite Lucy. <laughs> so today Lucy's going to be culling my wardrobe for me. She doesn't get the final say. No, right? This, this is no, not, no. Like, this is not signed and even... sealed, but this is uh, to get a friend's you know, idea of what I should keep and what I should not keep. An idea that does not come from within my own head, with my own irrational, illogical reasoning. Someone nice and neurotypical is going to do for me. <laughs> so Everyone's favourite neurotypical nuisance, <laughs> Lucy! <laughs> you asked me to put two racks yes, here. Yes, yes, um, I did. So, what are the, what do you... Well, you initially just wanted one rack of things that I think you should get rid of. Yes. However, I kind of, you know, I'm all about the grayscale, you know what I mean? Like, they, we just, we don't move in black and white. And I think I will have one where I'm kind of like, I know, like, what you wear. I've seen you wear clothes. I feel like I can say that. Lucy's seen the real me wear clothes. <laughs> You've seen Alex wear clothes, not I've just pretty like pastel, the please. the full spectrum of your fashion, like, and what kind of stuff you like. And I, I have a pretty good feel of, like, I know there are things here where I'm like, I know you love that, I'm not going to touch it. But there's certain things where I'm like, I know you don't like it. Like, you've told me, like, I just never like wearing this, I don't like this type of thing. Mm. And there's also things where I'm like, I know what you wear and know you don't wear it. That goes on the, I think you should maybe get rid of this rack. And then there's the other rack, which I thought is like the, please explain. <laughs> Classic Australian fashion. Please explain. The please explain <laughs> rack. In which it's kind of like, stuff where I'm like, well, this is nice. I've never seen you wear it. Or I've, and maybe you've said things about it or even like, I just don't like how it sits on me kind of thing and it's like okay so we need to decide if we need to like fix it or like you know are we gonna get it tailored or something like that are we gonna make it so it can fit into our wardrobe or do we agree that like it can move on it's time to the afterlife it needs stopping in your like closet purgatory does that, <laughs> does that kind of make sense like this is the stuff where I'm like okay like overall I think we agree it's probably gonna go and if I'm wrong by all means I'm you know not my circus not my monkeys don't mind if you keep it but then the other one is like I'm confused I need you know some clarification here, yeah. please. Please explain. I am going to leave the room for you to do the culling, and when you're done, if you uh, just yell or screech, um, screeching always gets my attention. Yes. Yeah. So I, I, I will come, that. and uh, then I'll question your decisions, and you may have to speak some sense into me if I get too mm. defensive over things irrationally. You I may mean, need to be just like a firm. I'm, I feel like I give like a, a loving firmness, but also if you were like to me like, no, I love this, and I'd be like, cool, well, like, let's put it in a bag, let's go today, let's go to the scene. That's let's where you and Caitlin fixed. differ. Really? Caitlin would be like, throw it in the fucking bin, it's garbage! <laughs> okay, all right. I wish you luck. Thank you. Bon voyage. Bon voyage. But before we tackle the wardrobe, let's thank today's sponsor, HelloFresh. HelloFresh is a subscription meal kit that delivers easy to follow recipes and fresh pre-portioned ingredients that are ready to cook right to your front door. There's no time wasted because you don't have to hop in the car and go grocery shopping. There's no food wasted because the food is all pre-portioned into the exact quantities you need for your recipe. There's dozens of recipes to choose from each week and most take only 30 minutes and some take 20 minutes or less with their quick and easy options. There's low carb, low cal, vegetarian and pescatarian options with fully customizable portion sizes and delivery dates. You can skip a week whenever you want and best of all, HelloFresh is sustainable. Their packaging is either fully recyclable or it's made from recycled materials. Go to hellofresh.com and use the code prettypastel70 for 70% off plus free shipping. That's hellofresh.com using the code prettypastel70 for 70% off HelloFresh orders and free shipping. I'm the kind of person who finds it pretty easy to do a declutter or clear out. I don't have like super sentimental attachments to a lot of items in general. If you have seen me on the internet before, then you would probably know that. <laughs> but I know that Alex does have some pieces she's pretty sentimental about. That's why I wanted the extra rack as well, because like everyone's got their own style, everyone's got their own things that they really like. So I'm I'm not a <laughs> I'm not a crack the whip kind of gal. More of like a, a gentle negotiator, a gentle I was gonna say ghost. That's not right. It's her clothes, her wardrobe, whatever special to her should absolutely remain here. But um, I know that, I know, I know some specific items that I'm like, let's talk about it. I don't really know where to start though. Uh, so many things. 
Okay. This one uh, actually caught my eye. So this one, Alex and I actually bought it together when we were thrifting for Thriftmas last year, I think. And it was because it was like up on the wall and it had like a Chanel label. So Alex was like, oh my gosh, maybe it's into Chanel. I think she still likes it and thinks it's cute, but I, I want to talk and see if like she still likes it now. This is the House of Sunny Hockney dress in the very famous like Kendall Jenner green print. I really like this dress. I know that people consider it like a micro trend or something like that, which I kind of get, but I also think that this dress is like still very cool. I think it just got very popular very quickly. However, I've never seen Alex wear it and I don't even know if I've heard her talk about this dress. I just want to like check that she's like gonna wear it because I don't know if this was like for a video or something. This one here is a dress from House of CB. It's a really gorgeous dress, and I don't know if she'd like wear it over a top or something, but in terms of sun dresses, because I think this is designed to be worn alone. Obviously you can layer it if you want to, and there's no rules in fashion. But I don't feel like I see Alex wear a lot of like sharing kind of details around like the top. Maybe I'm wrong, but I have another dress there as well. If she likes them and she's into them, then that's totally fine. But I'm just like, I don't think I've ever seen her wear that or like lean towards it. I usually like to ask a little while later because it's like, it was for a video at the time, makes sense. But it's like six months later, have you worn it? Or is it is it still interesting to you? Or are we happy to send it free? So there's that one. Okay, so these two are quite similar, but essentially this is sort of the same thing I was talking about with that dress before about like necklines and stuff. She has both these dresses and I know she likes them or did like both of them. But one time I was hanging out with Alex and she was like getting me to try on some clothes and she got me to try on this dress. And I tried it and I was like, oh, this is so cute. And she was like, yeah, I'm not really sure about it anymore though. Like she just felt medium on it. And I was kind of like, okay, well like, you should, I think she should like try it on and like decide because I know she's already got down. So that's my thoughts. And then this one I thought would be a good comparison because they're sort of similar but different. Maybe it can help us uncover some, some identifying factors. You know what I mean? Investigative fashionism. Now before you, you know, I, I, I agree. It is incredibly cute. It's got quite a few and I just want to know if she like wants to keep them all or if she just wants like, if she has some favorites she wants to keep or she wants to wear them as loungewear. Cause like I haven't seen her wear these like out and about in a while. And same thing with this one here. I think it's like a cute thing like in the background, like obviously, you know, it calls back to the like iconic pastel backdrop. So totally understand it there, but I don't think I've seen Alex wear this and I don't know if it's something she would wear now, but maybe she would, who knows? But um, yeah, I feel like this one maybe is just for, for the vibes. Uh, and you know, as a content creator, I can respect that, but I just, I don't know, just ruffling a few feathers being a bit, a bit frisky. These are a couple of pieces from a brand that I know Alex really likes. It's an Australian brand called Scanlon Theodore. And I think she found quite a few like thrifted pieces on salvos and stuff. Sorry, there's a pigeon. Is that a pigeon? How odd. So I know Alex has picked up quite a few like secondhand pieces that are like obviously very good deals because it's a bit more of an expensive brand. So it's exciting to get these deals, but I don't think I've seen her wear either of these. I kind of want to know like now that the thrill of the deal has maybe worn off if she would still wear either of these guys. And I'm morally confident about that. And then this coat is really cute, but I know she has another one quite similar to this that she really, really likes. And so I don't think she needs both. They're in very similar colors and similar cuts and everything. We'll find out Mads. I think I've pretty much done what I'm gonna do today. Could go more ham, but I think there's a lot the stuff to look at and talk about here already. So I'm gonna grab Alex and grab her back. Yay, okay, be right back. Alrighty, come on in. Welcome. Welcome to the the square of doom. Well, okay, the back part you can just ignore. That's- Wait, that's, hang on, you're- It's just this one and this one. Oh, no, 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 those are the, those racks were already there with stuff on them. Ah. Okay, so as a friendly reminder, this is the, this is the I'm moderately confident that you may not be into these things, but I'm not sure because you may have a secret reason that I didn't know. Yeah. But based on what I know, I'm aware, but I'm happy to talk. You don't have to get rid of anything if you don't want to. <laughs> this is a safe space. Okay. Um, but then this one is the like, I have questions. Where would you like to start? Would you like to start with the... Not there. Not there? <laughs> okay. So, 
This one is do from Mossman. Do you want me to tell you why I put it on there? Because it's got a tag on it? No. Because I went through and there's some other ones that I feel like I've maybe seen you wear or you like more. Mm. I know it's Mossman and you, especially Mossman and Scanlan, we're going to be having a couple of chats yeah. about them. But there is another <laughs> off-the-shoulder Mossman dress yes. that is black. So I was like, do you want both? I would probably need to try this on with the other Mossman's yes. dress. I figured that might be the case. See, some of these are intentional conversation starters because there are other things I looked at and I was like, maybe if we talk about this one. And I, I was like, she's going to bring up the other Mossman black dresses that are cocktail dresses. Eh? This one. Oh, right. Interesting. Why did you pick that one over this one? I just thought in terms of what I've like seen you more into and wearing lately, Especially what the stuff you wore at Fashion Week and stuff. I don't know, I think this is more your current style than this one, sort of, to me. Only because this one doesn't have as much of a shape to it. It's like more... Okay, well, I think I should try those on. Yes, I'll make, make a little pile. Bring, yeah. Oh yeah. Or bring another rack or something. Funny that you put this one here. Yeah. You know the subscribers have been around for a long time when yeah, they recognise yeah. this. Yeah. Oh, I, mean, I believe I made a, a joke about looking like, up. looking like the Ice King from Adventure Time. Oh. <laughs> When I wore this. It's I, so soft inside. But you have other jackets that are really soft inside. Not this soft. Well, feel. But do you like the outside? You've said you've been trying to get rid of it. I don't it. like anything about it. Okay. Other than it's soft inside. Well, let's go on an endeavor. I'm happy to. Definitely <laughs> no! Happy to help me find, find you something that's also just it as has soft to be inside. equally soft. Yeah, I'm sure. But yeah, brand new with tags. I've yeah. never worn it out of the house. I don't think. All right, that, I think that yeah. Go. <laughs> this I thrifted this, and uh, every time I think about getting rid of it, I decide not to because it reminds me of one of my favorite designer brands, hmm. Blue Marine. Oh. And you know Blue Marine with all the the frilly, flowy, asymmetric, yes, yes, yes. pink. Yeah. Um, except, well, this is witchery. So it, it's quite a nice brand, yeah. but since I thrifted it, I have worn it several times. Okay. But I've never worn it in public. I've only worn it around the uh, house. So, okay. so that maybe can, that can go. Really? Yeah. Okay. Cool. Um, there is no conversation here. I'm sorry. Oh, okay. I, I feel like I remember when you got it, but I don't. I haven't seen you wear it. I've worn it many times in oh. personal occasions, like okay. to Easter lunch. Oh, and stuff okay. Like that. This one. I've worn this many times too. Oh, it's see, from, this is the. I was talking about this to camera. I was like, I was like, I've never seen you wear these yeah, kinds of things because yeah. I'm not usually here for your like family lunch. That would be a little bit weird. I've worn this to family lunch actually. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Uh, I really like this one. You can see the next one. It kind of ties into this shearing detail. Yeah. I was like, I don't know if you wear it normally over another top with stuff like this. Mm. This is the House of CB I'll one. I'll keep the House of CB one and yeah. get rid of this one. Okay. Would you rather wear this to like a? Uh, because there's sort of different occasions, right? Sort of. I want to keep it because it's House of CV. I understand the reason. I don't know if it's a very... You have plenty of House of CV. But like, true. Because it's it's a black sundress. Are you Do you wear... Because you quite like coloured sundresses. Time, no You're question. Right. I should keep both. Good idea. No. That's not the outcome. <laughs> okay, well, mm, if you put these with the other two, uh, the maybe, the maybe part. Because I guess also, I picked these ones because these were the questionable ones, but there's so, you can't really see on camera. There are like eight different sundresses. Like I kind of was looking at this one and I was like, oh, that's kind of pretty. Maybe, like, no, maybe not that. Interesting. But you, well, I, I picked it up and I nearly put it on, but then I didn't. Let's get rid of that one. Okay. Yep. <laughs> All right. I this is from Black Milk and it's cute. It is really cute. Yeah. I've worn it once. I don't find this cut flattering on me, so I tend to never wear it mm. because every time I wear it, I, I, I wear it for the the cuteness of the print. Mm -hmm. It's like unicorns, but yeah, yeah, yeah. that's the only reason I wear it. That's so, why I put it back. <laughs> yeah. Because I was like, oh, oh, it is quite cute. I was like, oh, it's quite different. Like it's a bit yeah. un a bit unusual. Okay. Well, then can I ask a like not to not to add you know analysis paralysis decision. But like, you like this black one, but you also have it in a peach yes. and it's quite similar. And this is, I feel like the style of neckline that I think you like more, but maybe I'm wrong. I don't know anymore. You don't know anymore? No. Have you tried them on with the new booba? No. Mm. <laughs> See, okay, good. Um, um, but we like this one. We do? Do we? No, do that you can go. I do like you it, but you can, can go. You can go. Because sometimes, you know, things oh. come into our lives and we wear them a couple times and we go, that was nice. Mm. Thanks for the memories. But you're not, even yeah. though they weren't so great. Even though they were medium, you know, here tastes like like a you, dry, sweeter. Christmas, 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 Christmas yeah. breast, one chicken breast. 
thanks for the memories. That was my text message tone when I was in grade six. <laughs> and my text tone was Glamorous by Fergie. G L A M O R. You've heard first class. O U S. First class. I've been chosen. Up in the sky. On a pigeon. Living on my life. Making its nest, it's the glamour dust. Oh, the paper pigeon. I'll try it. You'll try it on. And read the side. Yeah. yeah. Okay. And I need to retry this one as well. I thrifted mm -hmm. this. It's Alana Hill. Yeah. I really like it because I like this. Um, what's the Queen's Gambit, Beth? You know. Oh, I like those sort of dark academia yes, yes, vibes. Yes, yes, yes. But this, the this is wool. I'm pretty sure. And um, I have. Like itchy. Well, I actually can't wear this because it irritates it's my skin. Times. And also the reason why I put it on there was because I was thinking about how we've talked about how when we first, sorry I just said that so weirdly, when we were first like met and stuff we were really into like dolly, yeah. kawaii and it reminded me of how when we talked about how we're like oh we're both kind of like we've like evolved or changed our yeah. style a little bit to be a bit, I was saying like more mature but I don't know yeah. if that's the right word. Or just, just more. more refined silhouettes. Yeah, like the dolly stuff was very cutesy and now I'm like, I, I don't mind a bit of sexy. You know what I yeah. mean? We don't mind a bit of sexy. No, we don't mind. We don't mind a bit of sexy yeah. in terms of like, you know, That's we you get on this channel. We like a little, little womp womp, you know. Whoa. Um, this is from Yes Style and I I keep this because I love the, um, I I love the outfit. That It comes with a, a turtleneck, like a sort of uh, glittery black yeah. turtleneck and I wore it to dinner at Tetsuya's with Dan yeah. years ago. And I've always wanted to go back and recreate the photo that we took. Okay. <laughs> so I'm keeping this temporarily and I'm going to oh, wear it gonna... next time okay. I go to Tetsu is Very valid sentimental And reason. then I'm going to get rid of it. <laughs> okay. I can't get rid of this sentimental. Yes. I thought that might be this the case. Is from it... the start. This is before I was on yes. YouTube and I was just posting on Instagram and I was just posting pastel pictures on Instagram and I will never wear it, but it's the sort of thing, yeah. I was going to say, it's a background piece. It's you know, yeah, you know how like people that watch football get a football player's shirt and put it up behind glass? Yes. That's this for okay. me. Okay, well you should maybe put it behind glass. Frame it. Maybe clean it first, but then frame it. That's True. also why I put it on there, kind of, because I was like, if you're not going to clean this, they you should. should poof. It was yeah. more of a reminder to clean it. Yeah. A gentle washing reminder. Pile. Washing Please. pile. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I've on multiple occasions gone to get rid of this as well, but right. I keep coming back to it. This is from AliExpress, uh, but classic. surprisingly classic. so comfortable and I really do like the little love heart, mm. but I haven't worn cutesy kind of things mm. like this in a while. Yeah. I'll retry it. Yeah. And see? I was like, I know you wore, it's, there's a few things like where I'm like, I know you wore this a lot once. Yeah. But you don't anymore. Once upon a time I did. And so we need to just, it, maybe if you try it on you'll be like, yeah, those days are over. Uh, this can is go. The exposure up too high? I'm not wearing my glasses. Oh goodness, it's very high. Yeah. Womp womp. Sorry about the technical difficulties. <laughs> so this one, this can go, but I've always kept it because it looked cute on the rack behind as a backdrop. I put it on there being like, I'm pretty sure Alex keeps it there because it looks cute in the background. Yeah, yeah but but you don't, it can go. Some, okay. Someone will really like yeah. it. Yeah. This I need to try on. Yes. I, this is a Scan Theodore top that I got from Salvo's again. I knew. I said that exactly. I was like, I think she went on a little bit of Salvo's Scanlon spree. Yeah, yeah. I, I want to retry this because mm -hmm. this is actually my absolute favorite length of top. Oh. Anything that comes down and actually sort of covers my butt. Oh. I, I love okay. tops that are this long. So, but I actually, I haven't, tried it on since I bought it. Okay. So I need to try yeah. that. And that was a similar one except this oh, one heavy. I was more this it's more I've never tried it on corporate either. kind of thing to yeah. me. So I was like I think you need to try it. I do need to try okay. it. Cool, cool, cool. Um this is from an ASOS haul, but now that I have my Alice and Olivia That's one. That's exactly what I said. <laughs> really? <laughs> I was like, I know she loved I know because I love you that. <laughs> got it like around fashion week and yeah. you wore it a lot and you're like, oh it's so because you were you weren't sure about it, yeah. and then you wore it, and you're like, actually, I, I love this. Love I'm going to keep it. And I yeah. thought you don't need both of no, the very, just the context, so you can see. It's They're a really nice, tailored, good quality, long line, and they serve the same purpose in your wardrobe. Like an occasion where you would wear that coat is an occasion yeah. where you wear this That's coat. True. Do you yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. So you don't need to. Also, this doesn't feel anywhere near as nice as that. So this one is quite a. She's plush. It's a real fine. She's this. <laughs> this Sorry. is a real fine. <laughs> Oh, wait, hang on, I think. <laughs> you reckon you can do it? Oh, oh toad or? Toad, please. <clears throat> oh boy! This is a real fine! This is a real fine! <laughs> Just buy it! You don't you have, have to, to rationalize, rationalize everything! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I will buy it! It'll be good for the economy! economy. <laughs> She's like a 
vending machine of noises, you just press her and like, <laughs> things come out, it's so cute. I just walk around and I'll be like, <laughs> like yeah. I'll just trip over something like, yeah. when Lucy's staying here, there's just funny noises come out of the room that she's in. <laughs> I'm just, you know, <laughs> I, I'm like walking and then I trip them like, what? <laughs> That was the biggest impression you made on Dan the first time you came and stayed really? with us. Really? Dan was like, the noises she makes are amazing. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if this fits me. This one, okay, with everything here I was like, none of these are things which I like, in terms of taste and vibe I question. This one is giving very peacefully, it says with almost peace and love, it's kind of giving, and I know it's meant to be like that texture. Are you about to say like Cookie Monster? No, I was going to say like Childhood Blanket. Oh, that's better than Cookie Monster. Yeah, no, I think, but it's giving, you know, when you like have a blanket that you wash and you wash and it kind of gets peeled and you never, it gives like that kind of vibe. He just picked on you. On you. Yeah. That's what he thinks of this, but I, I do want to try it because okay. I've actually never tried it. Yes, let's try it. And this, I keep this because I really like the shade of it. The mm. color is really nice and also nice and fluffy, but yeah. also I hate that it's shiny. Oh, I've never well worn that's, it. I okay. might have worn it once. Yes, I wore it in that, I did that how to be a Gucci model challenge. Ah, uh, yes, yes. And I, I wore it in that. that. So, ooh, but this can go. I, okay. oh, I actually just put it there because it's a, um, it's like two sizes too big for you as well. So I figured. It's the only one they had left on ASOS from memory. <laughs> I'd have to yeah, go back and watch yeah. the video. But I, I was figured, super into, you know, the sax pots. Yeah, well, coats. you got a couple as well. I went through a phase. I mean, and I wanted them in every color. Anyone that's been following along with my whole mental health journey, because there's probably a lot of people that are gonna be like, what the hell is she talking about? But for anyone that understands what I'm talking about, since I started my medication, I now no longer have the desire to have this coat in every single color. I can now, with peace and love, just have one of the coats. One of the coats. And in your favorite one. Yeah. 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 All right, well, bye. <laughs> this one, this is actually representative okay. of the large amount of Hello Kitty, Hello Kitty jumpers. Which I've already culled a lot of. Yes, you have. So I just wanted to just, it was more of a like, a gentle check-in. I don't wear this because I don't like it directly touching my skin. Okay. I like to wear it with a turtleneck underneath. Mm -hmm. The turtleneck that I bought to wear underneath this has holes in the sleeves. So mm -hmm. I need to get a new turtleneck that mm -hmm. I can wear underneath this. Would you still wear it now? Like if we were going to go like to Woolworths, would you wear it? Or would you wear something else? It would definitely be a consideration right yeah would it ever win yeah it might it if might. i had the turtleneck okay all right so i think okay. i'll keep i think I'll yeah keep i it. figured i know you keep some of them for comfy stuff but i know the comfy stuff you wear is like what you're wearing now not yeah. this stuff and then your going out stuff is different so it sort of fits in that middle category which yeah. is why i asked about it but okay. okay 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 this is a we need to try these on because these oh, are two okay. oh i'm so sorry did i hit you you hit my knuckles i'm so oh my god i thought you were saying your nose now about so this one actually uh, the reason I had to stop wearing it is because the zipper did that oh. thing, you know, where when you zip it, it oh, doesn't it's actually broken. go together. Oh, it oh, just goes up oh. and down, but it never seals. So I need to get that repaired. Oh. I don't know how to fix it myself. If I had to choose, I would, if I had to choose, I would pick that. But come to think of it, so this, this one, is made much nicer. I was saying last time I was here, and then we we had that time when we played dress ups. Yes. And I tried it on. You're like, it's so cute, and I was like, agree very cute oh you want so, it no i was i just want to say i think if you take like it, it no i please take no, it no 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 please. no 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 we said Lucy. that you had to try it no, on with you your new boots please you have to try it on with your new boots i don't want boobs. to i want you to take it but i want you to please try take it, it. Okay, but because i'll try it then i want you to take it well but can you try it i can try it that's fine but i'm not going to fall in love with it no because i want you to have it and i know that giving you something that will make you happy will make me happy but i don't need to be happy but i want you to be happy but i'm already happy Happy I don't, this won't, it, I approve, look, here's the thing. If we get to the point where you want to get, get you, hey yeah, hey yeah, oh, sitting Eilish. in the corner yeah. of the it's room, <laughs> everything song. reminded me of you, sorry. I only listen to K-pop <laughs> now, except for maybe some pop songs, maybe just, mainly just pop and pop, K-pop, pop, <laughs> pop, 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 pop. Nylon stands right up. Okay, right up. Um, yeah. No, the, and also okay. because I know on. the other House of CB dresses have that really tight, yeah. and you got the new bazonkas. Yeah, yeah. So I need a. Yeah. And you said to me last time that you hadn't tried them on with the new bazonkas. I haven't tried any. So we probably won't do that in this video because I think you were going to do a video trying on, maybe. Can you just look at the camera. Yeah. What? Lucy's wearing the hottest accessory of the season, <laughs> guys. Just so you know. It's really exclusive. It's an original creation, one of one. Dumpling. Dumpling's feather. 
Okay, so yeah, they're like... Need to get that fixed. <laughs> yes, need to get that fixed. Okay, oh, that goes into the... This is a hard one for me. This is from YesStyle. I wore this to Dan's graduation and yes. the photo... I've seen the photo. It's and a very cute I photo. I love that photo and I really like this dress so much, but also I haven't worn it since graduation, uh, since his graduation. And I, I keep it because I'm like, oh, if, if we go to like a medieval festival mm. or we go to a Viking themed restaurant or mm. some, or I, I'm pretending that I'm from Skyrim or something, I can wear it. But how often do I do those things? To be fair, I actually don't think this would even fit me anymore because it used to be kind of tight. So ah, now okay. it'll be with very, the, this, yeah. this can go. Medieval Some, times someone's were not prepared to... for the exact CCs that No. Were. <laughs> <laughs> no. It's interesting that you've put this here to get rid of. I really like this, but I've seen some pictures of myself in it. And when I look back on those pictures, I don't like it. So I like the dress. It's a brand that I really like, Faithful mm -hmm. brand. But I, yeah, I just tend not to go for it. That's always the hardest though, isn't it? When you have something that you're like, I like this piece. Mm. This one is because, yeah, this was just the same thing as the blue one where it's been occasions where I try and you'd be like, you look so cute. And I'm like, well, you should try it on. And you're like, oh, yeah, I haven't worn it in like X amount of time. I should try it on. So this is just me being like, you should try it on. I should try it on. Yeah, you should try it on. And I'll hate it just as much as I always hate it, but I'll want to keep it because it sparkles. Mm. But you have the black sparkles that you like more. And But see, that's the thing where I'm like, they still make this dress. You should get it in a small. No, but I would never buy this again. Like, the thing about dyspnea, you have to be at a place and at a level of comfort within yourself to wear dyspnea and not be concerned. And I'm like, there was a tiny black speck on your head hmm. and he was going all around it. I was like, is he trying to get that one black speck on your head? And he did. <laughs> Sorry. He's, he's Just... look, who needs a, sh a shower when you've got a bird that cleans you? Um, yeah. When you were wearing this, I could see your butt while you were walking around. And uh, like, I could see your undies, you know, you yeah, had, yeah, you had yeah. really pretty, it was you had pretty nude undies nude, on underneath. Yeah. And I just kept staring at your ass in, 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 with peace and love and, and all yeah. the respect. I was just like, wow, her bottom is lovely. Um, but then, it was good because I can't see my butt and that's how I was able to move forward. Yeah, <laughs> uh, and I was looking through some photos from Fashion Week and I was thinking about this dress and thinking about how nice it looked on you because you have a really beautiful curvaceous figure and like you, it, on me, I have a flat ass and I have Let's use some more neutral language around this. My glutimus maximus is not very maximus. It's more minimist. Yeah, Min minimalist. We have different body shapes. So yeah. this is never going to suit my body shape, even if I got it in my size. It's not going to suit my body shape. So or I suppose it's not something that you would feel empowered and lovely in, which yeah. is what this dress is designed to do. Look, Rather than it's not going to suit you. Amazing. Gen Z. They, they know the right words. <laughs> I don't know these words. <laughs> <laughs> Did you like the black one on you? Like yeah, the black one's being got... Um, yeah. Yeah. Yes, a and it's lined. lined. It's yeah. lined. If this had a, if I this guess, was lined, oh well, but that's a fix, is it? But you could take it to a tailor, and they would be able to put a lining in for you. All right. Well, let's let's put this in the pile okay. of get shit done. <laughs> Good. This has to stay. Yes. Because I see this as like a collector's piece. Okay. Again, sentimentally, this is from. Roger that. I think it was my very first ASOS haul that I ever did, ah, and it got a lot of views. And I bought all these things from the Hello Kitty collection and I kept the tags on this and I have a black one yes I saw dress, that too. and this one and Archie actually shredded a whole bunch of the sequins off the sleeve <laughs> I don't know if you'll be able to see but I came in one day to find him munching on this and all he was doing he wasn't eating it it's not like he was hungry he was just chewing off the sequins and throwing them on the floor so even though I kept it brand new with its tags it's now rendered it's been a munched rendered Worthless <laughs> to anyone else but me because it still means a lot to me. The sequence falling off as we touch it. And looking at it brings me joy. So I think that that's a free pass. That's a valid. That's a valid one. Yeah. Oh, okay. This one I wanted to ask. I haven't. I, I haven't, haven't tried it on yet. Right. Okay. So you need to try this on. So there, like, there's a reason I haven't tried these was it things for a video? on. No, I actually bought that for myself because oh, cool. I really like the silhouette. But I literally because um, you know I have this in a different color. Do you? I have the blue crush one. Oh, I was really tempted to get for that. our for our fated eventual aspirational girls trip. Oh, our trip to <laughs> we will take. We'll, we will eventually, That's we keep saying we'll go. Really? Yeah, because everyone on TikTok was like, the green Kendall Jenner dress. But I was like, I still think it's cute. I still think it's cute. Great, okay, I can't <laughs> wait to see you try it on. And I see there's two more things. Yes, nearly done. I just know that you hate the strawberry dress fabric. And I know you wear the strawberry dress, but I don't know if you wear the strawberry shirt. So I actually got the strawberry shirt for Sam and oh. I was gonna do a photo shoot with him. Uh -huh. um, and I got, uh, strawberry dress for Caitlin. Not and done. Don't don't pull on that dumpling, please. 
Garni, Garni, please, it's Garni. a very beautiful Garni, Garni jump. Hang on, you must call him in the way that pigeons call each other. Oh my god, why is it working? Because that's how pigeons communicate. But you got to speak their language. But I'm a little rat lady, how can I do that? <laughs> so, um, yeah, that's for a photo shoot, and once okay. we've done the photo shoot, it can go. Alright, um, and then this one, the this final. One, we bought this together, you yeah. remember? Yeah, I've, people will remember it from Thriftmas. Yes. People really like it. Yes. I really like it. I think yes. it's adorable, but also I haven't worn it since I bought it. It's that fake was my Chanel. Question. The reason why we bought this is now no longer the reason we have it. You know what I mean? We bought it because we thought it might be real. Yeah. And now we know it's not. So yeah. if you still like it, I think you should. And I do you like still, it. I think it's you, very cute, but do I... Do you wear it? I don't remember the last time I wore red. Yeah, no. It's just currently not in my repertoire. Repertoire. <laughs> so that can go too. Wee. Oi, wee. Wee, wee. No. Poo, poo. Ha, ha. Ha, ha, ha. So we that's... That's... That's it. It. Everything else is allowed to stay. Yeah, I mean, I guess I didn't want to like overwhelm with like, I don't want to like pull a whole bunch of stuff out, but especially with some of those things like, if you try on the House of CB dress with that cut in that size, mm. now with the new boobah, and yeah. you go, yeah, this isn't it, yeah. then we should try on the other ones as well, because that yes. would probably, do you know what I mean? Yeah. So yeah, I think everything else, like I know why you have it, and obviously with like the kind of stuff we do, it makes sense to have like a variety of things, and I know some of these things in the videos, and I know like, I like to think I know I'm like, she would style it with this and like we're keeping it for this type of occasion which has not occurred and things like that. Especially like all these, like a whole bunch of stuff here I was like, no, like all this stuff here. Yeah. I was like, I know you all have yeah. worn all of this recently and yeah. liked it a lot so I'm not going to touch that. But Well, yeah, I have an idea. Mm -hmm. So, uh, we've been talking about trying these things on but I think the video is probably pretty long at this point. Probably. I think this should be part one. Mm -hmm. Well, theoretically, I was saying it was part two because Caitlin, you know, helped yeah, me. Yeah, yeah. But no, we're going to reset. The Caitlin video is a, a different thing. Okay. New new series concept. New series unlocked. <laughs> Level new up. Concept. Let's go, baby. Um, so now that you've put those things aside, mm -hmm. let's put those things for the try on mm -hmm. in uh, this rack here. Mm -hmm. Then for the next episode, we'll send in another friend. Send in Michelle, for example. Yes. Then anything I know I'm getting rid of, I just immediately get rid of. Mm -hmm. And then the other stuff that ends up being filtered back in again mm -hmm. with yes. the next person. So I'll then take the collection of things that were need to try this on and I'll try them all on in a wardrobe clear out video just on my own. Yes. So that way it's like, okay, well I know five friends have come through and out of the five people, four of them put this thing on this rack here. Yes. So that should help me to right. make my decision. There you go, that's it. That's episode one. Thank you for standing in Perfect. and doing my job for me. Well, yeah. with that, uh, go head over to Lucy's channel. It's lucy.livin on Instagram and Lucy Livin on YouTube. Links in the description box below. And uh... <laughs> I was just, I'm always the worst. Every time you do it, being like, go, and I'm always just like. <laughs> so yeah, you, she's great. Go subscribe. And with that, thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye. Mm -hmm.